So I'm inside PowerPoint here and one of the most common things you'll see is that we want to be able to present presentations to maybe the board or uh, important directors in the organization on our investments. And part of that scenario would be was coming into the slides before your meeting and having to update information here such as maybe the stock price as you're going live into your presentation the day before. Another thing that obviously concerns people sometimes is that people will upload that PowerPoint deck to OneDrive for Business and then share that link to these files with people within the org and that data will become out of date almost instantaneously especially things like stock prices. If we go to the store here we can actually go through and search for the stock tile and add that directly to my environment and just trust that there because all it's going to do is um, send data over the internet and you'll see here that we'll get this little tile and I can put in the stock price code from Microsoft here and you'll see what that's doing is pulling a live feed um, from the internet of that current stock price and the movement in here and the nice part is is that I could kind of just have this directly in my presentation maybe I want it a little bit larger here so I can kind of grow that tile exactly how I wish it to and for instance I could even have more than one in here too so I can go to my my add-ins and grab the stock tile here move that over to the side again kind of resizes exactly how I want it um, and go in here and put in something like Google as well and so again you could have a nice start comparison slide deck here of all the different stocks that you have within your corporation that you want to compare the stock tile will also work inside Excel so you can see if I select a cell in here and click insert I have the same experience with inside of Excel where I can select my stock ticker and in include that tile or maybe I'm doing presentations straight from an Excel spreadsheet to my my board with other calculations and graphs that I may have added from data within the sheet if I want to work directly with the information in here what I can do here is maybe I'm going to keep a record of the shares that I've got in a particular stock the price and the value in the change percentage and I want to check out Microsoft here there's another add-in written by the same vendor called stock connector what this allows me to do is I can come over here and actually enter and connect to Microsoft stock and it's going to ask me to put where I want the price of that stock and click OK I can also come over to the side here and as well as bind to the actual stock value I can bind to the percent change and you'll see when I click on that box it's asked me to ask where I want that bind in and I can just select that sheet so in this case if I had 10,000 shares of Microsoft stock I could write a quick formula here that times that by the price and that would give me a rough estimate in value here of uh, what we were doing what you'll see on the right hand side here is we can actually refresh this immediately by clicking here or wait every 15 seconds to push those changes through and naturally that will then update any of the calculations based on the stock price and that percentage of change. So this is a great example of using information stored outside of Excel from real world systems inside of your Excel spreadsheets and your PowerPoint presentations.